You like my intro? It turn you on? This ain't nothing. Wait till I put some new videos on. Ah, what's good, y'all? It's me, Tina Marie, with True Meaning of Radiance. You miss me. I know you miss me. I miss y'all, too, y'all. I was sick on and off, and then I just wanted to take a break from social media, like, as far as YouTube, so I took a break, but I'm back, and we got a lot to talk about, so let's get into this edition of Candle News Network. Uh, the wallflowers are on sale for $2.75, and yes, that's me holding up the tools and the deuces, because I'm gonna be all up in the stores acting a fool online. I believe you have to use a code, but in stores, you don't, so I definitely am going to be acting a fool in stores. Plus, if you got some coupons, you can throw the coupons on top of the 275. Yo, I am about to be wilding in the store. If you're going to be in the stores wilding with me, let me know. Be 275 is one of the price points I've been looking for. But first off, I want to say this to Santa. Unless you're taking me to the North Pole, I am not paying you $36.95 for this holder. What is this holder doing for me for $36.95? absolutely nothing i do not like this holder whatsoever uh for the wallflower like the projector night light like it looks like it's worth $18.95 like max $18.95 is going for $36 but the house one that one was really cute and it goes with my theme so I'm really thinking about that now candles are still $14.95 yes it's not as good as the $12.95 but throw your coupon on it you can get you some nice holiday candles for the low low so I think this will be a good sale if you combine it with your 20% off get your candles get your wallflowers just do it all at one time like today is that day like i feel so festive today is that day i go on bath and body works and say hi like period now since galore who is the chief financial advisor if you're not following her go follow her y'all she posted some of the new bags y'all probably already seen it i kind of saw it but i didn't of course post on it but i'm posting on it now and these are really really cute so i hope when i go to the store today they have these bags if not i'm going to be kind of disappointed now my girl tiffany vanessa 35 hey girl hey boo she showed the new um bombshell that came out for holiday this year and you all can find that on her page she also shows some of the new scents from victoria's secrets so if you're not following her you definitely need to she'll keep you up to date on different uh brands you know kringle everything like tiffany vanessa be doing her thing she's also on youtube as well so go subscribe to her youtube just let her know i sent you at tmr2886 to let her know what she's doing is not in vain we definitely appreciate the work she put in and that holiday is super super cute now i have to give it up to my girl it's underscore self-care girl thanks for showing um another product that was new from the dub now my girl um plug by amber i showed y'all plug by amber stuff and plug by amber showed the whole collection of the new dub she said stay away from that sugar cookie though she said that's play though and we don't play what i do okay so play though can't go so sugar cookie i'm definitely gonna be staying away from so it's self-care and plug by amber y'all need to be tapping in with both of them now y'all i was all up in the five below and look what i found yes new stuff from the five below um they had new holiday scents lotions sprays they even had holiday um scrubs and y'all on top of that they had candles and soaps so the soaps were going for 350 all the body care stuff was 350 but the candles were 555 such a weird price but y'all they're super cute and they had the shoes like i'm about to go back today hopefully they still got the good stocking because they just put that stuff out so if y'all will be going to five and below and y'all want me to do a video on five below let me know now pamper underscore mint y'all i've been falling in love with her lately um on her page on instagram she showed from nordstrom rack that they had the barbie crocs like you know the things that go inside the crocs or whatever because i lost almost all mine for my crocs i ain't even want cap i don't know how y'all keep up with them charms i can't keep up for charms for nothing i can't i don't know why um but she posted that they had that they had some peppermint mocha and milk and cookies um hand cream every time i think of milk and cookies i gotta do it like bernie mac some milk and cookies top of here some cookies and milk <laughs> <laughs> but yeah so they got that out there um in a new page i just found i just started following her i know it says follow right there but i followed right after i took the little screenshot but it's kathy fines she found some real cute stuff if you're trying to do that pink and white and like pastel theme for your christmas 
perfect because this is what i'm trying to do like i'm already in christmas halloween gone i already went to christmas like it's christmas in my mind and this is the theme i'm really going with for this christmas the pastels and just having a pretty pinky christmas i know y'all like but you got boys so i got a daughter too so it's all good you know plus it's my house i do what i want and they could just live there or they can leave period <laughs> but yeah i'm gonna be doing it big with the pink all throughout and if y'all want a tour let me know now another person that i found was target gems show off some of the new new that's at the target now i'll be loving like the whips and when they have the holiday whips that really do it for me so they got hot cocoa this time salted caramel they got the gingerbread and they got the peppermint now i want um I think they had a marshmallow one. I think it was marshmallow. I want the marshmallow. Where the marshmallow one? Because that joint was slapping last year when it was out. Let's get into my final thoughts. My final thoughts actually is from John Legend, okay? And he opened up about how limiting his social media use has improved his mental health. It was just a lot. And that goes back to my point of why I took a break. It was just a lot. I want to live in my real life, if that makes sense. I wanted to live at least a week or so in my real life. I've been living in the social media world. And when you um, do social media and you're into music, so that means you're in the music scene too, and you do all these things, it is so easy to lose touch of reality where you live in an unrealistic world you just really don't be in reality no more and i really got to a point where i was not living in reality and i wasn't appreciating my kids and i wasn't appreciating my home life i wasn't appreciating my relationship because i was so much into social media like seriously so sometimes it's good to take a step back and leave social media alone like i was dabbling here and there but i was away like y'all know my post wasn't really coming on my on music page or my um bath and body works page and definitely not on my vlog channel or my main channel and vloggers yes vlogs will be coming back um, but I just wanted to take some time and get into my reality again and tap into me and tap into my life and tap into who I am because I was losing myself. I was losing myself in social media, people's thoughts, what they were saying, people unsubscribing, people not wanting certain things from me. And no, now I'm back to me. So now I'm back to the basics and I encourage y'all to like sometimes if you need to just take a break from social media because you will get so engulfed in other people's worlds and this fake reality because a lot of the things you see online is fake. I don't care what people try to put on you. A lot of things that they're showing you, they not even live in. Go ask them Instagram models that sleep on mattresses on the floor and it'd be three of them in one room but want to sit there and act like they always on vacations. Okay. All right. So definitely, if you need to take a mental break for your mental health to get back to your reality, I encourage you to do so. That's what I did, and I think it works miracles. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember, rate, comment, subscribe. If you didn't check out Man Eater or Elm Street, they're still popping on my music slash vlog page. So go check it out. And DJ, you know what to do. Play my music.